got these statistics about it. Take care of the ball pretty well. How do you sort of try to force the issue against that? Right. Try to get they, them out they, of the game. They've got guys like Van Vliet who uh, doesn't really uh, get a lot of turnovers. So um, we just got to stick to our game plan that we've been doing, um, our scout report, um, our film sessions. If we stick to that, we should be okay. Right, do you kind of get, I mean, I know it's a tournament series, not in any way, but uh, it just start flowing a little bit more, knowing that this is a backcourt that's pretty highly touted. There's some guys that a lot of people like. Oh, yeah, definitely. You definitely want to show up against that, and uh, we think we got some stuff to prove. Just talk about a little bit the whole week, you know, going from Saturday and then the, or Friday, excuse me, the uncertainty of the tournament situation to Sunday, seeing Bell's name up on the board. What was that like? And then also just your experience here in Omaha so far. Um, everyone was really just excited to hear our name at the number 10 spot. Uh, we feel like we deserve that. And um, just coming here, it's a huge, huge uh, honor for us. And we're just going to go out there and play our best. What when you when you watch Wichita State on film, what 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 stands out the most? Uh, their physicality, offensively and defensively, they play really well together on offense. They know how to. Van Vliet knows how to get his guys open, and um, also on defense, they they help each, they help each other out a lot. What uh, what is I know Nick's played against them in the past. Has he, has he talked to you guys about about yeah. that at all? What, yeah, he how, what's he said? He's talked to us about um, some of the players' tendencies and stuff like that. Um, what they do. And uh, he just showed, uh, told us like his experiences against him. I just asked him for a breakdown of the uh, when you all threw the ball around in the baseball park yesterday, and asked him who had the strongest arm, and he said, "Not James." What's, what, what's he saying that for? <laughs> no, I was I wasn't trying to throw my arm. That's why he said that. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> how much is important for Hunter to play? I mean, how badly do you guys need him tomorrow? Um, it's really important for us to have him on the floor. Uh, all the things he brings, um, rebounding wise, um, and he just gives us that inside presence. Um, personally, I think he will play, but either way, um, we're gonna uh, find a way. You guys are a young team. How how do you guys overcome that rather quickly in this kind of environment? Yeah, they definitely have uh, a lot of experience. Um, they've been here multiple times. Um, we've only had two guys that have ever been in the NCAA tournament, but uh, we also got guys who have played in big games and big environments, so um, we should be okay. Tomorrow. One of those two guys told you about how the environment is different, and I'm not just talking about you know the hoopla, but I mean once the ball is tipped, how things are different. Uh, he just told me. Uh, I talked to Yogi a lot about it. He just told me how it's going to be. Um, it's like nothing else that he's ever played in. Um, even though he's played in big games, it's like nothing else. So he just told me to relax and just play my game. Don't worry about anything. James, when he came.